Hello everyone. Question today. If you could have a thousand dollars, what musical equipment would you spend it on? For me, I will spend a hundred dollars on an uh, item I mentioned later in the video. And the rest I will spend on VSTs and probably a desk. <laughs> Today's video, I'm going over gift ideas for producers at three different levels of production. I everyone been producing consistently. The new been producing for at least a year. The mid-level producer producing from two to six years and anyone over six plus years, I consider them an expert. I'm gonna start off with the new producers and everything I'm gonna name for them is going to be cheap because who knows that they're going to keep producing. The first cheap gift I'm gonna talk about is Expand 2. Now I went more in depth in this VST and this video up here. Expand 2 has synths in it, pianos, strings, you name it, just all your standard VST instruments. Now, if you're lucky, you can catch this VST for $10 around the holiday season, like now. But depending on when you see this video, the holiday season is usually from November to January. So it's always on sale for $10 between that time frame. I will recommend it. This one VST I have, and I do like it as a beginner friendly VST. You have to make sure you're using decent sounds. That simple transition will improve your music tenfold. The next gift idea is a MIDI keyboard. Now you could use your normal computer keyboard, but nearly impossible, at least for me, to fluidly play out my thoughts on a keyboard. So this is Akai Professional MPK Mini MK3. It is a beautiful mini keyboard. It comes with 25 keys, so you can at least get your chord progression out and you won't be able to dual hand it for real, unless you're just doing like one hand solos. Other than that, it's a perfect beginner MIDI keyboard. I've had one, but mine broke. It lasted me for about three years and I got a second hand, so that's pretty good. The next gift idea is a speaker. Usually speakers have more sound clarity and quality than headphones at a cheaper scale. You get more bang for your buck and it's easier for you to share your music all around. But the JBL Flip 5 is only 80 bucks. I have the JBL Flip 4. It's a water resistant, not proof speaker. You can use it in the shower. You can pretty much use it anywhere outside with plenty of bass for those who need bass and plenty of high end for those who love their top end. The next gift idea, I mean, you can just get like a 20 to $50 gift card or just, I mean, if you want to get it the legit way, $20, $50 gift card, just let your producer, friend, significant other, just let them buy the drum kit. Don't buy the drum kit for them because you don't know what they want and it'd be very awkward. And the most important gift a new producer can use is an external hard drive. They are very cheap nowadays. I found a Seagate two terabyte external hard drive for only 61 bucks. That would last them for at least a good five years <clears throat> and then some, that's a lot of space. But moving on to the mid-level producer. Now, once again, the mid-level producer been producing consistently from two to six years. At that point on, we can start talking about more expensive things. So I have cheap and expensive gift ideas for them. Starting with the cheap. All right, you're probably wondering why didn't you recommend a audio interface? Well, that's because it's expensive. Now for your mid-level producer, get them an audio interface if they don't already have one. Audio interfaces unlock a lot of possibilities for setting up your studio. You can connect your studio monitors to them. It's the speaker right here. You can connect uh, microphones, guitars. It, it opens up a lot more possibility and it increases your sound quality. The next cheap gift idea would be a condenser microphone. I recommend the Audio Technica AT2020. It's the one I'm using right now. This microphone goes for $100. And when I purchased it at the time, it was around 80. I'm recording in my video software, so my voice may not be as processed, but this is probably better for the microphone test because this is the raw microphone. And for what I believe, it sounds pretty good. I had it for about a year and a half, two years and zero problems. The next gift idea are bare dynamic headphones. DT770 Pro Studio to be exact. Now I have a pair. Yes, this is tape. That's a whole different video. The Bear Dynamics go for 134. Sound quality wise, love these headphones. These are the 250 ohms. I recommend the 80 if you don't have a audio interface that can actually power them. My current audio interface doesn't power them correctly, so I don't get the full sound clarity, but from the sound clarity I get, very good headphones. But they do lack on the bass. So for those who want to hear some bass, my other recommendation headphones are the Audio Technica's ATH M40 Xs. And these headphones I also owned previously in the past. The sound quality on these headphones are nice, but the build quality is questionable. These are $119. Next up, I'm going to talk about some effects. VSC effects are wonderful. They can add so much depth, color, just emotion to the most basic melodies. And I know everyone heard of it, but everyone don't really have it. That's the thing. RC20 is a beautiful VST. I personally own it. I own it for 
about two years now. I can't emphasize how many melodies have been saved with this single VST. And it's only a hundred bucks. When I got it, it was on sale for 60. You can get it from 60 to 100, but without a doubt, it is worth the $100. We are on the road to 100. Subscribe now to become one of the OG 100 Gs. Let's get it. Let's run it up. Let's go. The expensive mid level producer gifts starting out is with one of my favorite VSTs at Pigments 3. Now, I have a video up here talking about Pigments 3 more in depth if you want to go check it out. It has endless sound customization, it has a granular setting, it has preset galore. I'm a preset guy, I don't want to spend all day sound designing versus making the music. Now, if you favor creating your own sound versus sifting through presets, then Serum is more your route. Serum is probably one of the best VSTs for sound creation, but that is the other VST I recommend if you don't want to go through the preset hassle, but if you love sound designing, Serum is literally up your alley. Now my next expensive gift idea for the mid-level producer are studio monitors. I have KRK Real Kit 5s and it's the third generation. They're currently on the fourth generation. They're the same price. When I purchased mine, they were 150. Remember, you have to get two. I almost made this mistake. The price only reflects one, and they don't really tell you this, but make sure you purchase two. They're $179 right now for one, times that by two, and they're about $358. I love to like just jam out on them when I finish a beat, love to listen to, you know, Spotify, Apple Music. Wonderful bass, wonderful high end. Doesn't have sub capabilities for people that wanna, you know, really fill that bass, you know, you wanna be held by that bass. It's not gonna really do that. KRK does sell a subwoofer but i don't have it x gift idea so i have the long-term audio interface and i have like the audio interface you want to try for like a two three years so y'all can go about this information however you like to go about it let's start with the motu m6 now no motu m6 is a brand new audio interface it recently came out i believe this year now it has four slots for you to plug in a mic guitar or any studio monitors has two headphone monitoring stations so your producer can have a headphone plugged in and the artist can have headphones plugged in it has monitors for the in and out so you can see the le active levels which is beautiful and it has four individual games for your guitars your ghost power headphones all that it's four hundred dollars yes it's expensive but for what you get this seems very solid this is the one i've been looking into to getting because i need to upgrade my audio interface but the sister audio interface is the moto m4 it doesn't come with all the plug and play accessibility you do get two imports for your microphone guitar and anything you need to plug into your audio interface it comes with six ports so you can plug in your uh, studio monitors it also come with rca ports so if you have older monitors you can also use it with the moto m4 versus the m6 but just like the moto m6 the m4 only comes with one midi in and out cable so you don't get a difference there. Now, the mini keyboard I mentioned before was more on the boring side. It's just literally just a keyboard for you to get your thoughts out. It don't have to come with pads. It don't come with sliders. It don't come with knobs. But this next one, it comes with all of that. <laughs> I'm talking about the Toria Key Lab Essential 61 Key Keyboard. It's 259. This is the one I want to get. But for practice reasons, I recommend the other one. But if you already set in like piano or just you know like three scales get this one because you have more controllability on your mini keyboard itself so you don't have to keep switching from controlling knobs on your in your DAW versus like actually playing using the nectar so this is the keyboard i have on my radar my next gift idea it's not really groundbreaking but a lot of people don't really do it upgrading your DAW. i am a fl studio boy because i'm broke <laughs> so i started on the free one you know you can't do anything so i got the fruity than the producer and the functionalities just from going from the basic entry to that one wow now this last expensive gift don't look at me like i'm crazy but i recommend the contact 14 standard package now the reasoning behind this is only 600 dollars but contact has some of the most premium sounds you will ever hear come out of a machine like the pianos the guitars the flutes the cellos the Literally everything, I'm not like having a heat stroke thinking of the, the sound quality. Just, if you want to save up for a VST and only get one VST for your authentic sounding uh, instruments, contact. And that's a huge sell. You save like eight grand. All right, so last but not least is the expert producers. I was just thinking, I don't really know what to get an expert producer because what do you get a person that potentially have everything? Nothing I'm about to say is going to be cheap. Everything's going to be expensive. 
So starting out, get them some studio time. Studio time price ranges. I did some Googling and in my area, it ranges from 20 to $200. Now my next gift idea is the Arturia Key Lab 88 key weighted keyboard controller. This one is $1,000, but it's the closer you can get to playing a actual real piano, you get like the weighted key response and still getting all your sliders, your knobs, your just MIDI keyboard accessibility. Expensive. Now, you know, we're only going to go up from here. <laughs> I believe every producer deserves to have their own synthesizer. The one I recommend is the Profit. Now, the actual Profit synthesizer keyboard is 3,500. We breaking banks out here. Now, my next gift idea are universal audio guitar pedals. If you don't know, you can connect a guitar pedal to your DAW. Then you can send your loops through the guitar pedal in whatever effects you can you want to do you can do to your loops you can easily make unique samples with just this guitar pedal they range from 400 dollars plus you can always ask them what guitar pedal they want or you can just give them like a 400 dollars gift card to 1200 dollars gift card but my last two gift ideas for the expert producer would be a audio interface but now i have two audio interfaces one is only compatible with mac devices while the other one is compatible with pc devices the apollo twin you know the one for a thousand dollars i recommend that one if you have apple devices you cannot use all the features on a window device now if you have a window device but want a premium apollo twin-esque audio interface i recommend you get that apple g symphony desktop now yes they're the same price at fourteen hundred dollars but the apple g is fully compatible with pc for more information on this check out the brother's video curtis king he does a full in-depth on this he took the l so we all can take the dub <laughs> thank you curtis i will have links down below for everything i mentioned today in the video nothing is affiliate link it's just there to make your life easier if you don't want to use them don't some things are on sale until you know january so if you see something you like to keep checking back please be sure to like comment and subscribe click on one of the links up here check out more content for me and i'll see you in the next video stay chilling keep creating